Hi guys, I'm so excited. I have completed this wave of basic dolls and the last one I needed to get was Darling Charming. And since I just got her, I bet you like in two weeks all these new characters are about to come out and it's going to take me forever to catch up. Well, what I need is a job, so I'll definitely look up on that and try to get as many dolls as I can. For now, I'm going on a Ever After a High hiatus because Brad's and Monster High, there's just so many that I want, and I'm putting them first before Ever After High. But I'm going to focus only on the basics for Ever After High, is what I'm trying to say, and then get every single Brad's and Monster High. So, I got her at Walmart, they had two of her, and I freaked out, like I was really happy. I would have periscoped, but Walmart has like, this like no Wi-Fi thing, it's, it's stupid, it just sucks. So, I love this doll because her coloring is my favorite color ever, like the baby blue, I love that color so much. So I'm gonna move her to the side, and I'll show you her accessories I guess. Here's her bookmark. It's baby blue, my favorite color ever. It has like this flag. Probably it's like the, oh, like the shield. I don't know. Well, it looks like a shield. Like the charming emblem. She's a rebel. She stands for a good cause and you, you could read that. Well, I'm not gonna let you read it. You have to get the doll your own. So, silver brush to brush her good hair. Her hair is very questionable, but we'll get to that one. We'll get to that. Um, here's her box. It says Darling Charming in baby blue. My favorite color. Oh my gosh, I love it. Her art's very beautiful. Then it says Darling, dar ugh, I can't talk. <laughs> Darling Charming on the side. Daughter of King Charming. Watch on Netflix. I can't wait to see her in the webisodes, since we did see her in Way to Wonderland and Spring and Sprung. I read some of the interesting things about her, like, um, what magic touch makes you special? When I toss my hair, everything around me starts moving in slow motion. Does anything make you shout or oh curses? People need to stop treating me like I'm helpless. And there's all the other stuff, the other characters, her beautiful, beautiful art. Just look at that face. She's very, very pretty. And all these little details, like with the pink, and yeah, it's not on the doll. Then she doesn't come with earrings. Watch Ever After High on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, and Netflix. And her best friends are Raven Queen and Rosabella. I love this doll so much. Um, okay, now to the doll. She has this beautiful, beautiful face. She has blue eyes, blue and purple eyeshadow, and like these pink lips that have some like shimmer on them. Then she has this one curl at the front that I recurled right now because I washed her hair. Now her hair is very pretty. It's like a platinum blonde. And it's this blue, baby blue, my favorite color. I'm just gonna say that this whole review. And it's pulled back right here and then it's kind of wavy. When you take her out of the box, her hair is a disaster. I kind of wish it would stay flat like this, like wet and flat, but I don't know how you would get it like that. And she has this little headpiece that's a flower and it has a heart. And it's like a tiara. So she's girly, but she has like some armor aspects to her. Then she, oh, she also has a beauty mark. I love her beauty mark. No earring holes or no signs that there could be an earring hole on her ears. Then uh, onto her dress. Well, she has these like armor shoulder pads and it's very cool. I love it. And little pink jewels. And then this belt that's like armor as well. And then it looks like tinfoil. And it kind of feels like it, but tinfoil is easily like to break. So it's very cool and it feels nice. And this pattern is blue. It kind of reminds me of the Way to Wonderland girls. 
this pattern. And then she has pink ruffles. And she has these little, like, mesh, glittery, pink... What do you call that? It just attached to her dress. Her shoes are kind of simple, but I love them so much. They look like chainmail. Let me zoom in. They look like chainmail. And they're just simple heels. And she has a purse. That's the last thing I need to show you about her. And it's it looks so cool. I love it. Okay, so now I need to make some comparisons. Let me bring Dexter here. Since they are brother and sister. See, oh, aren't they adorable? These two dolls I love so much. I like Dexter's, um... This one better, the Date Night 2 pack Dexter. So, yeah. I love Darling. So now I want to know from you guys which one of this wave is your favorite? Mine? Oh gosh. I just realized that I love these all. I love all of these. I could tell you who my least favorite is. At least favorite it's Faybell. But I love her. I love this whole wave. This is probably my favorite wave. I say that every time, but I didn't for the last one. The last one was like Kitty, Duchess, and who was that other one? Kitty, Duchess, and Ginger. But this wave is absolutely beautiful. So there's Rosabella, Faybell, Darling, Bunny, and Alistair. I think Alistair and Rosabella are my favorites. They're just so cool. Darling really stands out from everyone, though. She has, like, a very gorgeous face. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Make sure to follow me on Instagram at AlistairWonderland1 and on Periscope at NathanielLira. Like, comment, and subscribe. Bye!